The King and His Ring. The king has lost his favorite ring. All the king's men look for the ring. They pull the chair away from the table. Under the table, they find an apple. They turn the pillow upside down. Under the pillow, they find the king's crown. The bird, Robin, flies out to play one day. He passes a mill on his way. He stands on top of the mill. He gets a shock. He sees something shining. It's between the rocks. Robin finds the ring. He takes it back to the king. The king feels very happy. He kisses Robin. The end. Helpful Bailey. Bailey is a lovely dog. Its eyes are very beautiful. Its nose is very helpful to policemen. It can run quickly when it meets bad guys. It is very careful when it helps old people. Young kids love to play with it. They are friendly to Bailey. Bailey makes them feel joyful. Bailey is very smart. It can do math correctly. We don't know how Bailey does it. We all love Bailey. The end. An interesting adventure. Pete and Steve went across a long bridge. An old castle was surrounded by hedge. A huge cage is in front of the castle. They walked into the castle and found a stage. It was too dark there, and Pete was scared. Steve touched something on the stage. It was an orange, and they ate it. They found a fridge in another room. They opened it, and a monster came out. They ran out of the castle quickly. They got a badge and laughed. They were in the fun fair. The end. 
Surprise! It's Mom's birthday today. She's going to have a big surprise. Jenny makes a lovely card. She spells every word correctly. Matt takes out some oranges from the fridge. He makes them into lamps. Dad makes a huge cake for Mom. Mom is back! Quickly! Let's get ready! Dad puts the cake on the table. Jenny puts the card on the cake. Matt lights all the orange lamps. Mom is so surprised. Everyone is joyful. The End The Country and the City Cooper lives in the country. He cuts wood with his father. He cooks food with his mother. He feeds cows in the shelter. He can even drive a tractor. Cindy lives in the city. She rides a bicycle on the street. She dances in open space. She races on the ice. She enjoys spicy food with rice. The country is nice. The city is nice. You can visit them both. The End The Goat and the Giraffe The goat and the giraffe go out to play. They play on the grass and walk far away. A golden bridge appears before their eyes. They cross the bridge. They ignore the warning signs. They see a huge house with many gems around. These gems are worth a lot of pounds. They see a table with some bread. The bread is as large as a sled. Suddenly, the giant comes out with a hare. The goat and the giraffe are rigid with fear. The giant tries to grab them with his magic hammer. They rush back home. They never cross the bridge, ever.
The end. All about me. I like to make new friends. I often take photos of my friends. I have many books. I can read them by myself. I like eating nuts and oranges. I always put them on different plates. I keep five birds in a cage. But they can't sing any songs. I have several boxes. You can find some toy buses, brushes, and watches. Do you know how many sides are on a box? Please tell me if you know the answer. The end. Jobs in town. People in town do different jobs. Actor is a job. An actor brings laughter to the audience. Doctor is a job. A doctor makes us healthy again. Professor is a job. A professor teaches students on a campus. Author is a job. An author writes books for us to read. Pilot is a job. A pilot flies a jet. In the sky. What job is your favorite for when you grow up? The end. Travel in the city. Jerry grows up in the country. He and his friends travel to the city one day. They take lots of photos. Jerry takes a photo of the birds. His friends take photos of cars and buses. They eat some yummy food. Jerry prefers the spicy noodles. His friends like hamburgers best. They read some books in the library. Jerry reads a book about giants. His friends read a book about pilots. They think the city life is different but nice. The end. The word world. Welcome to the word world. Say hello to the words sun and glasses. You will meet a new friend. Sunglasses. Say hello to the words snow and man. You will meet a new friend, snowman. When sun 
meets flower, the word sunflower comes out. When black meets board, the word blackboard comes out. Moon and cake will make the word mooncake together. Foot and ball will make the word football together. Do you know how to make the word fireman? Do you know how to make the word rainbow? Come to the word world. The end. I felt so good. I felt so bored. I began to draw on a board. I got bored again. I knew I could do something new. My father threw a ball through the window. I threw the ball farther. My mother bawled at us and said we were not right. I came back. And began to write a tale. Once upon a time, a man had a tail. He went off to the sea to see a whale. Whether the weather was good or bad, he would swim with the whale. I liked my tail. I felt so good. The end. Jill and Bill. Jill and Bill are good friends, but they are different in many ways. Jill is thin and tall. Bill. Is fat and short. Jill's shoes are clean and new. Bill's boots are dirty and old. Jill likes swimming in hot summer. Bill likes sliding in cold winter. Jill is awake in the morning. Bill is still asleep at noon. Jill likes a sofa that is soft. Bill likes a chair that is hard. Jill writes with her right hand. Bill writes with the left. Jill draws a beautiful flower. Bill. Draws an ugly bug. Jill likes the huge elephant. Bill likes the tiny ant. However, they have one thing in common. They both like the zoo that they have already been to. The end. What can light do? Why do you wear sunglasses when the weather is sunny? It's because there's sunlight in the air. Light can go through the air and. Other clear objects. It will bend when going through glass or water. 
We can see a bent pencil in the water. Light can make shadows. We can make animals on the wall. Do you know what color the sunlight is? Spray some water on a sunny day. A beautiful rainbow will be in the air. The rainbow is seven different colors. Those are the colors of the sunlight. The end. Gift time. Jill and Bill flew to Animal Town. They brought gifts to all their friends. They gave a pink skirt to the bird. They gave golden boots. To the horse, they gave a brown suit to the owl. They gave a purple mask to the hare. They gave some beautiful plates to the skunk. They gave some helpful books to the squirrel. They gave a lovely sunflower to the giraffe. They gave a pair of sunglasses to the bear. Where is my gift? Said the tiny spider. He got a huge fridge. The end.